Hey guys, Rivetead here. Welcome back to another episode of Cube World. Everyone's enjoying themselves today. Happy Wednesday. Oh, it feels good to be back on schedule again. Not gonna lie. Um, it just feels nice that I've been free to do a bunch of other stuff. Uh, I've needed the time, uh, as you guys uh, will know, is that I've been busy. <laughs> uh, life is really busy. This time of year is just insane. So, trying to keep track of everything just... Bleh. Well, we're dead. <laughs> ah, should revive, I guess. That's what I should do. Um, that was no bueno. That, why did I do the stupid? Why? Okay. Well, we're here. Um, so, yeah. Been busy doing a bunch of other stuff. Uh, work has been good. Uh, my schedule this week has been shifted to 11 to eleven to 8. That's what I'm working now. So, um, decent schedule. I don't mind it. It's been decent. Uh... Why am I so freaking far away? Like, I'm not even in the same biome anymore. Get me back over there. Uh, yeah, so it's been busy at work, uh, as you can guess, the final week before going into, uh, <laughs> before going into the, to the holidays. It's been, it's been exceptionally busy. Um, but I like the shift. Things are good. You know, it's not, uh, not too, uh, not too, I, I get in, it's busy. Comes down a little bit before I go home. So it's just a nice balance. Uh, the only downside is the bus. It kind of sucks. Uh, the bus is fine. It just takes a little extra time to come and get me. Um, so it's not just readily there. So I end up waiting a little bit. Uh, which is fine. Like, I don't really mind. So there is no huge rush for me to get uh, to the bus shelter. It's like, it's going to be ready. Like, I I'm going to have like 15, 20 minute wait no matter what. So it's not like I'm in the heat. Bada boom them, my friend. Wally, great at that. That was a whole lot of bullshit for nothing. We died for nothing, Wally. Well, I died. You didn't die. I don't think you did. Um, so yeah, it's been busy, but I've enjoyed it. Uh, but my focus for the last little while has been just getting all the rest of my crap that I ordered. It's been a nightmare getting everything. Finally got the last bit today. My phone finally showed up. Um, they tried to deliver it on Sunday. Quote, unquote. Um, I was there when they dropped off my parcel notice and said that, uh, you know, it would be ready for pickup. I'm like, uh, do you have the package? They're like, no, you have to get it at the, at the post office. I was like, you suck. Uh, so that's what I ended up having to do. I uh, went to go pick it up on Monday before work, and it wasn't there. So then I had to... Go back again this morning and pick it up. So I was like, dear God. Well, that's exactly what I didn't want to do. Yeah, so I had to go back this morning to get the rest of it. And get the, the package in. Uh, I've got the phone. It's plugged in and charging right now. Because, like, I've got... I don't care. <laughs> really. I, I'm so tired at this moment that I don't want to deal with it. Um, so I put it to charge. I'll, I'll, I'll fiddle with it whenever. Like, there's no huge rush. Um... My plan is paid for until the end of the month. Uh, if I activate the phone, it resets everything to be a brand new, like a, a new, um, a new billing cycle, I guess you could say. And I'm in no rush. Like they've made me wait uh, two weeks plus, it's almost three weeks now. Um, so I'm gonna get, and uh, yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna wait. Um, I'll wait till the, my end of my billing cycle, and then I'll start it over fresh because. I don't, I don't feel a reason or need to justify turning on activating the phone and then having to reset my plan. And then what I end up having to do is pay for partial month and then pay for partial month again. I get dinged twice and I always get screwed over by it every time. Like they did it once for me and I ended up paying like $18 for a day. I was like, how is that justified? And they're like, well, that's how it's prorated and blah, 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 blah. I'm like, oh, whatever. I'm just done. So I'm on, I'm on the verge of just saying, you know, I'll wait until whenever, um, which is fine. I'm not, like I said, uh, I can see how the phone works for a couple days before I activate it too. And that way, if I don't like it, then I can return it without any fear because I'm still on the fence. I'm not 100% sure if I want to have a um, uh, the Samsung phone. Like, I, I don't know anything about it yet. It's uh, I picked up the A70 um, from everything that I saw. Looks like a decent phone. Looks good. Uh, 
I, I got nothing against the phone. Um, like, the phone itself is fine. Like, I really, I, I don't have any issues. It would probably be a great phone and it might work great. Um, it's just the fact that I'm locked into a two-year contract for a phone that I don't... I'm not... Uh, uh, I'm not 100% sold on it. The reason I got the phone, there was a couple of uh, perks that were coming along with it. Uh, there was like a Visa gift card and a bunch of other stuff that I was going to be able to use for other things uh, that are now not an option. So I'm kind of pissed by that. I kind of got screwed over because apparently the promo was only available if you got it in store and a whole bunch of other shenanigans. And I'm just like, ugh. So yeah, I'm honestly on the verge of just telling them to take the new phone and shove it. And then just picking up a cheap phone on uh, Amazon and just, you know, paying 100 bucks for a phone and just deal with the fact that I don't have a, 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 you know, an amazing phone for camera and stuff. And just take the extra money that I would be spending on the phone and actually go buy myself a freaking camera, you know? And, and I don't want to, I'm not looking for DSLR or anything like that. I'm, I'm talking like, um, like an action cam or the DJI has the, um, what's it called? The Mavic Pocket, I think it is, or something. It's a little pocket camera. Or they have the action camera, which looks nice, too. Um, but I'm not going to do anything with that probably until February. Um, I don't really see the need for purchasing anything. So that's kind of my, my thought process right now is that, um, you know, just suck it up. And, you know, and the thing is, too, is like if I get a cheap phone with a plan, Jesus Christ, that guy's wrecking my day. What the hell? Are you fucking kidding me? Goddamn ranged characters. Every freaking time. Ruining my day. Um, yeah, so anyway, I could pick up a cheap phone. Um, or just use the one I have currently for a while. Uh, and then just say the hell with it. Get the cheap plan. Pay $30 plus a month for the exact same plan I'm doing now for 50 bucks and change. And then just, like, if a phone pops up one day that I really, truly want... I'm not bound by a contract. I can sign up whenever I want. They got a good promotion or something. And then maybe do it then. Um, I should have done a lot of this thinking before, but I kind of got sucked into the whole Black Friday thing and, you know, the want, the needs, and the... Ugh. I became a consumer. I became the thing I didn't want to be, and it's fine. Um, so, again, I'm not... I'm not yes or no to the whole thing, but I'm like, eh, meh. But, yeah, we'll see. And, again, um, I'm mostly put off because of the fact of a few things that happened. Got nothing against the phone. The phone's going to be just fine. Um, and like I said, everything I heard about it's good. Uh, what was I going to talk about? There was a couple things that I wanted to talk about, but I'm so tired. Um, yeah, so because of the new schedule and everything else that... I, I'm still getting up like at the ass crack at dawn. Like waking up bloody freaking early. Because I've had so much stuff to do. I've been having to get up and go to the post office and everything first thing in the morning. So I've been leaving the house at 8 o'clock. Or I don't have to be at work until 11. And like every time I'm doing this, it's just like I'm getting to work a little bit early. Oh, dear God. You're going to tell me you don't get hit? I hated that thing. Um, yeah, so I have had... I've been like nonstop all week. And then I, I have I'm working five days. Have Saturday off. And then I have back on for three days when I'm off for Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. Um, which I'm looking forward to. Really looking forward to. I'm going to spend some of that time doing some of the, the filming and stuff that I've been trying. Uh, what are you? That's a Wraith, yeah. Not going to mess with him. Um, I have been fiddling with uh, Hit Film. Uh, it's decent. It has some quirks that it would never work for what I do here. Like the the video game recording, no. Um, it's a piece of shit for that. Uh, the issues that I would run into is that when I do my recording here, I keep everything in separate audio tracks. So I'll have my um, video in one track and my audio in a second. Or sorry, my game sounds in one track and my audio from my microphone in another one. And it works great for me. Um, you know, recording software does it for you automatically. But HitFilm, for whatever reason, does not recognize that secondary audio track. You can't just load it in. You have to load in your video track twice and separate out the extra track. And like, it's a whole bunch of hoopla for no good reason. 
And the other thing that's a bit of an issue is that with my microphone here, uh, my sound uh, card that I use, um, it's a professional one, but it only records in mono. Ooh, we did something. Uh, so the audio is in the left speaker only. So I have yet to find a way to make it uh, go to both. Look at this. There is that. Ooh. Now, is there... Have I been here? I have not. So I was just thinking, can I... How am I going to get over there now? That's a long haul. This is going to be a hike. Everything is on the other freaking side of this place. Which is fine. I'm not going to bitch, but I'm going to bitch. Um, yeah, so anyway, hit film is... It's good. I like the effects that I've got into it. So when I'm doing my recordings with the camera and with the phone and everything, we're going to be fine because... Um, my audio recorder that I use for vlogging and things, uh, that, that is in stereo. So it's not going to be an issue. Um, I'll re I, I won't be recording audio other than using that. Um, so, and the visual effects stuff is what I want hit film for. So I'm okay with having two different pieces of software for what I do. Like, I, I don't have an issue learning more. I'm more than happy doing that. Um, and potentially it will help... You know my my workflow the more you learn the better you get right so it might be i can do more with this stuff i don't know you know i like i said i'm not opposed to anything i like challenges i like learning and uh it's definitely pushing me in that direction so yeah all of the um all the things that i've done for the last few weeks have been good i'm feeling happier i'm feeling healthy um i'm feeling good about the channel i'm feeling good about myself um, and the little bit of a breather and a break has been exceptionally positive for me. So I want to thank everybody uh, for your patience with me during this time. You know, I'm not giving up, as you can tell. I mean, I think my workflow is still there. Um, I've been having a freaking blast uh, playing Undermine and Wreckfest. Like, I just love the fact that I have two other games other than this that I can goof off and play. Uh, Red Dead, just goofing off and playing that on my own. I played it initially as a series when I had on the PS4, and I honestly burnt myself out of it. And I think that's one of the things that happens to me is with this is I'll get into some of these story-driven games, and they're fun for what they are, but when interest wanes on them on the channel, my interest wanes. Uh, where it shouldn't be that. Like I like to focus in and goof off and do my thing, and, and I'm fine with it. Uh, so when I do it at my own pace without the, the pressure of the channel on it, I'm good. So these kind of games here are fine. Or small story-based games that are like 5 to 10 hours. Um, those are great for me too because I can, you know, plug those away in a weekend. Um, or in a week, you know. And then record and, and, and record that whole thing and edit it out into videos. And then I have, you know, content for a little while. Um, but... Red Dead is like 50 plus hours to complete and you know as much fun as it is whoo that's a lot of video game playing um, and it's a lot of recording and a lot of talking and trying to stay in character and whatnot so it can be problematic um, we found a thing I see a thing here this is going to be um, either good or bad I'm not too sure yet um, you guys got anything for me uh huh you got nothing. So these are green mana pumps. Okay, we should be good. I like this kind of stuff because it's just quick and easy in and out. These do not take a lot of stress and aggravation. And it's, you know, the challenge is not much, so we'll, we'll take a bit of damage and stuff, but... It's not like it's a, like purple or anything like that. We'll just... It's just something to do. Might bruise a little bit. That's okay. I like clearing these things up. This is, this is actually kind of entertaining. And we'll load up on some of the, the stuff. Probably what we'll end up with is uh, a plethora of junk items that we don't need. Which is fine. I'm good. Um, the other thing that happened tonight when I got home. Every freaking game that I've been playing, like for the last while, everything updated today. Uh, Wreckfest got a, holo a holiday update, which looks amazing. Um, the uh, Undermine got an update with a new dungeon level 
level four, which I'm far from. <laughs> hey, if you probably watched, you know that I'm not the best, but I enjoy the hell out of it. Um, so yeah, Wreckfest has got a lot of new stuff as well. So um, the next couple of days, I have, and, and you know, this is all me. I have more than a few videos set up in advance because I've been doing a little bit of recording to make sure I have stuff available. And I have two Wreckfest and three Undermine pre-recorded. Yeah, that's me. That's who I am. So now I've got a whole bunch of more to do. And I'm like, son of a gun. You know, just as I'm getting ahead, now I've got to, you know, make new content again because dang nabbit. I got new uh, new levels on it, and I'm looking forward to playing them. That's the great thing about the games, is that they are a delight to play. And so with the new content, I'm excited. Uh, uh, Deep Rock Galactic got an update as well. Um, trying to think what else happened. A bunch, like, I literally had, like, ten games update. Destiny 2 got an update. Um, what is the other ones? Uh, no Man's Sky got an update today. Uh, and I just was like, how? Like, why? Why today? It's like all days, every freaking game that I have installed. I ended up with 12 games getting updates today. And we're just like, that's insane. Like, out of nowhere. Just like, okay, there you go. Bunch of new content for you. Happy holidays, Rivet. Like, woo! Look at me! That was a weird sound my throat made there. It was almost like a resonating uh, in my head. But it was out of my throat. No, you do not, Water Mage. You stay away. Um, am I killing this thing or? Listen, you. We haven't met the big bada boom boss yet, have we? We have destroyed all the stuff, though, haven't we? All the mana pumps are there. Ah, uh, we'll see somebody here that'll want to wreck our day. There should be somebody that's like three or four thousand, you'd think. Maybe not. I have no idea. Maybe just. I have no idea. I got nothing. We're just wrecking it. I don't care. We'll just destroy everything. Thank you. Nope, you're not. Okay, that was good. We're getting a lot of free bottles. That's a nice treat. Um, let's just do the ninjutsu. Get out of the way. Okay, well, we'll just take out the zombies. Okay. Uh, is, is that done? Have I done enough? Did I kill all the fools for you, you big jerk? We'll go back and chat with him. Maybe he'll tell me that I've done enough or not. Uh, unholy pact. Let's just... Okay. Oh, great. That wasn't with the guys I needed to mess with. Um, yeah, we're almost there. That was weird. Did not expect to get my ass handed to me quite so succinctly, but I did. Um, I was thinking everything was green. I didn't even recognize the fact that they were purple. You know, I should have. You know, it wasn't like they were hiding the fact that they were bigger and badder and, and you know, badder asses. But no, I just have to do my thing. Uh, so, yeah, I have a boatload of games to play and... Not a lot of time to play. Um, I'm going to try tomorrow mo or this morning coming up to get some stuff done. Um, I'm not too sure if I have the ability to. I will see. I have a couple things that I... Oh, God damn it. Really? You're going to have more come in? But I killed them all. Yeah, these guys suck. Suck on every level. Oh, God, I hate them. Really hate that. Really hate that. That's such a shitty mechanism to change. Like, I don't know which one I'm going to do. And you can't do it right every time. Oh, God, look at that. Even then I screwed it up. Um, let's craft up a couple more. I can make eight more. I just have enough of the the water flask and flowers. How? Serendipity. It happens from time to time. Um, yeah, so we'll see if I have the time to do the content in the morning. I might try to do an episode of Wreckfest or something or Undermine and see, but putting up a secondary episode uh, this afternoon. 
if I have the time, I will try. Um, I'm also supposed to do laundry at some point. <laughs> I'll have to double check, see if I have enough clothes for today, which is tomorrow for me, but I'm not sure yet. If I have enough, then I'll put that off for another day because I would like to just have a morning where I don't have to do a damn thing. You know, it'd be delightful. Why? Why are you guys back? Um, you know what? Let's do this. Just because I just don't feel like messing with it. Take a power. Okay. Let's ignore these jerks. And I'm just going to run just in case. But yeah, I don't like the mages, man. Never have. Never have. You're all a bunch of jerks. And let's go see if this guy will pop up and just say, Here, here's all my gold. There it is. Thank you, my friend. I got an emerald. Enjoy your day. Pleasure doing business with you. Don't call me. I'll call you. Onward and upwards, my friends. Onward and upwards. Uh, another 10 minutes to go. Um, and that's the other fun thing about the game. Is that... Uh, that's the other thing I've been noticing, too. Is that I've been... Less focused on time as of late. Um, like when I'm recording. Especially doing like Wreckfest or Undermine. Um, I'm just getting into groove with it and having a blast and it's been a good balance. Really good balance. Um, I'm also digging the one video a day. I'm not going to lie. That uh, extra layer of stress taken off has been delightful. Uh, I think it's helped me at work. Uh, I've definitely been able to have more focus. Um, I don't feel tired nearly as much. Oh, I know why I'm feeling tired today. Uh, that has nothing to do with um, the gaming or anything. That has everything to do. Well, that's the other thing. Is like with my schedule bouncing like it has been for the, the little while. Um, it's hard to maintain and get that that schedule in because I was coming home and recording a couple episodes. Now when I come home, I don't have the time. Like I can record one episode and maybe one in the morning. Uh, or if I've got a bunch of things to do in the morning, I don't have the time to, rec to record that second episode. So it's kind of, it's a double-edged sword with every with the schedule and everything. And, and I'm, I love the job. Like, again, don't, none of this is me bitching and moaning about it. But it's, um, a lot of what I do here is dependent upon a schedule. You know, me having the time to do things. And, whoo, I'm, I'm happy doing the one a day. Um, it's been allowing me to record every day um so I'm, I'm i've ample recordings if i miss a day i'm good um you know i'm not behind the ball whereas before is that if i missed a day i'm down two videos and like that's hard to catch up from sometimes and it'd be like that's why my weekend would be just a constant slog of me recording you know, and trying to find something to do, and that that that's just unmanageable for me anymore. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty certain that that time for me is done. Um, especially with all the other stuff that I'm trying to do. I got um, finishing off the computer set's done. Um, that one is set up. I've uh, got the lighting and everything organized. Everything is done there. Um, contemplating doing a. A, a, a review of my smartwatch that I got. Um, digging it a lot. I picked it up. I came in, I don't remember what day. Saturday, I think. Friday. Um, been using it every day. And I'm really liking it. Um, and again, I don't have high expectations for this stuff. It's a $40 smartwatch. I'm not expecting it to, you know, cook my dinner for me or anything like that. I'm expecting it to do a few basic things. And what it's been doing has been outstanding for me. Um, and it's it's done the one thing that I was hoping I would have happen, and that it's forcing me to be more active. That's the only thing I really wanted. it For 40 bucks, that in itself, it would have been worth $400 for me. Um, it's keeping track of my, my steps. And so I'm seeing how much I'm moving every single day. Um, and it's delightful to know that I'm not as lazy as I thought I was and that I am getting in upwards of over 10,000 steps a day going back and forth to work at work uh, everything and I'm like okay this is a good sign 
Um, but what it else is doing is it's inspiring me to go out and take more walks. And because I can keep track of things, I'm like, okay, I'm halfway through my day and I don't have nearly enough steps. So I'm going to, you know, I'm not going to take this bus. I'm going to grab this bus. I'm going to get off at this stop and walk. Um, and I think that little kick is what my personal brain needs. Like I'm, I do like to focus and pay attention to the fine details for myself, but, um, I lack motivation at times and I'm finding that this is the right kind of motivation for me. So I'm enjoying it. Um, the notifications I get on it are great. The watch faces, eh, it, it could be a little bit better. Um, it doesn't have a whole lot of options for watch faces, which is fine. Um, I kind of knew that going in, but it can, the, you can only hold four in memory for in your whole thing. And I'm like, oh, okay. So it is it is what it is. Um, let's check this stuff. Linen gloves, I don't think that's any good. We should be good there. Let's get out. Um, nothing there. Nothing there. Nothing there. It's all, yeah, it's all weaponry that I can't use. I still need chest, feet. Rings, we're, I mean, it's we're not doing horrible. I mean, it's we're far from doing horrible. Um, we should check for potions. Where's that dude over here? Potion right here. Uh, I'm gonna check to see if I have to buy any more of the flasks. Probably not too many. Ah, fair number. Enough. Enough to warrant me to... Uh, oh, God, that's a lot. Okay, I didn't have squat. Okay. Um, is there a... Okay, there is right here. Good. So what I was curious about is that I, I've been not paying enough attention in the villages and getting a place to sleep nearby. And so at nighttime, I'm having a hard time finding villages to pop to and just go and turn it to day and then come back. Um, so... The, I just before I did this recording I had to change it today uh, and so I was like I'm going to take a look around here because I hadn't found this one yet so okay don't care uh, this is not as close as I would like but it's good um, we'll just wander over and we'll end things here nice easy day nothing too fancy nothing too uh, nice and relaxing feels good but after I'm done this a little bit of wreck fest because I got to see the holiday edition man got to see what they're adding to it and also undermine man that game is just torturing my soul. Uh, thanks, everybody, that has been giving me some tips and tricks on how to play the games. It it, it It's amazing, and I appreciate it. Thank you. Um, never, ever, like, you know, back away from offering suggestions and things. Um, you know, like I, I said, I do record a lot in advance when I can. Because I do like to have a backlog just in case. Um, but, um, you know, I will get to your input and put it to use. And... 99.9% .9 of everything that's been said has been exceptionally useful, so I do appreciate it. So thank you, everybody, for that. But I'm going to end things here, uh, climb the mountain, and call it a day. Once again, I want to thank everybody for your continued support on the channel, not just on the channel, but with Cube World and everything else as well. Um, I know it's a, an, an interesting time for me. Um, I'm happy. You know, the channel is doing what it's doing, uh, slowly dying, <laughs> and that's to be expected, like I mentioned before. Um, that massive growth of people that came in for the cube world, um, over 2000 people slowly, they're dwindling away and YouTube is doing what it can to get rid of people as well and getting rid of old accounts and blah, 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 whatever. I don't care. I'm not here for the numbers or anything like that. I'm here just to do this. And, uh, the, those of you that comment and watch and, uh, you know, and enjoy what I do. Thank you for that. I appreciate it. And, uh, I'll see you guys Friday in our next episode. I had to stop and think. It was like, what is my schedule again? I don't remember. Uh, yeah, so it's uh, Sunday, Wednesday, Friday will be our schedule uh, going forward. Unless I decide to throw in an extra video because that will happen from time to time too. But anyway, I'll see you guys soon. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye.